Hi there, I'm Homa Dumont from the Government Information Service. This is your Midday News Brief. The Nobel Laureate Festival Committee officially launched its 28th anniversary of activities. Honoring St. Lucia's two Nobel laureates, Sir William Arthur Lewis, who was awarded the Nobel Prize for Economic Sciences in 1979, and Sir Derek Alton Walcott, who was awarded the Nobel Prize in Literature in 1992. This year's activities are being held under the theme Celebrating Excellence, Challenge, Uncertainty, Opportunity. Bank of St. Lucia has been a supporting partner of the Nobel Laureate Festival for over a decade and is continuing in that vein lending financial support to the festival in the amount of 5,000 EC dollars. A new addition this year will be the opening of the Sir Derek Walcott Library, which will house his impressive collection, donated by Ms. Sigrid Nama. The Departments of Sustainable Development and Agriculture has signed a Memorandum of Understanding for the Jeff 6 East Coast Southeast Project. The five-year project will focus on ecosystem management, landscape restoration, and sustainable livelihoods on the southeast coast of St. Lucia. The Division of Forestry will be assisting with establishing at least one marine protected area, as well as the restoration and rehabilitation of mangroves, seagrass beds, and coral reefs. The Jeff East Coast Southeast project is estimated at approximately 4.4 million US dollars. The Division of Human Services is celebrating another centenarian. Victor Roseman Smith achieved the momentous milestone of reaching his 100th birthday. Mr. Smith, born on 1st January 1921, is the last surviving child of 10 children. He was born and raised in Saltaba, Chosel. Mr. Smith was a farmer who was very passionate about his cows and gardening. His family shares fond memories of him entertaining them with folk stories and playing the guitar on rainy days in his younger days. Mr. Smith has been a resident of the St. Lucie's home for the past 10 years. He is the first centenarian at the institution. Although he is bedridden and his speech is faint, his jovial nature remains strong. We celebrate Victor Roseman Smith, St. Lucie's latest centenarian. This concludes your midday news brief. Stay tuned to the National Television Network. Until next time, I'm Huma Dimark.